I didn't want to do something where the market would like inevitably create it anyway. I wanted to try and do something where hmm. if I don't do it, it doesn't happen. That's what drew me into biotech. It was just, this is an interesting category. How can I help? What did you learn as you did the research tour? Or like, what were the key pieces that led to Curie? There are so many things about drug discovery that are basically the opposite of software. That's what got me to, you know, to just get really interested. It was like, oh, this thing doesn't work in any way like I'm used to. In software, you can make a lot of mistakes in the product, including like bugs in the code and features that don't work or building the wrong thing. Or in many cases in startups, building for the wrong customer and figuring it out later. And the reason you can do that in software is because the mistakes are small and they don't take up a ton of your time and money because they're software mistakes. That shit does not work in biotech at all. Uh, it is the opposite because in drug discovery, you make something, you test it, and that cycle in a therapeutics company is months or years and hundreds of thousands and in many cases, millions of dollars. Mm -hmm.